，欢迎来到 Forty Phoenix 自然音标。Forty Phoenix 自然音标的课程，今天老师为你介绍的是 Vocabulary of the Day。Vocabulary of the Day。同样的，我们今天可以到 cn.com、edition.cn.com 去寻找本日的 Headline News of the Day， 并且从中去学习一些，找出一些单词，去学习它的拼音技巧以及逻辑。Okay, students. Let's go to the cn.com and search for the headline news of the day, and we can probably learn picking out some vocabulary words and learn how to spell the pronunciation skill and the spelling、uh, tips. Okay, let's go to the cn.com, the front page of cn, and, and、uh, under the session around the world, and here I see. Uh, an interesting topic. The headline title: Top Ten Things Africans Most Worry About. Top Ten Things Africans Most Worry About. Okay, let's click on the article title. Okay, now we will see the inside news of this story. Okay, and again, students. If you want, wish to study with me with this article title, if you do, and please,、uh, on the top right hand side, right here, the top right hand side on the search menu right here, please type the article title exactly the same, so we will having the same、uh, article. Uh, same story, okay. Okay, let's check. Today's article title is the top ten things Africans most worry about. The top ten things Africans most worry about. The top ten things Africans most worry about. Okay, I guess I'll、uh, do probably a survey or probably service、uh, to the people that living in Africa and, and check、uh, what are the ten things they worry about. Okay,、uh, in the beginning I, I will see or、uh, uh, we have see some、uh, workers, factory workers are in the assembly lines.、Uh, okay. Let me read the description. Unemployment: A new survey by Afro Barometer, a Pan-African non-partisan research network, reveals the most critical problems and priorities for Africans across 32 countries. The number one concern mentioned by 37 percent of the survey is. Unemployment. Okay, I'm going to read the inside news for you guys. CNN. What do Africans worry about the most? According to the latest report by Afro Barometer, a Pan-African non-partisan research network that publishes surveys on governance on the continent, the answer is. Overwhelmingly, unemployment. The data comes from over forty-seven thousand face-to-face interviews conducted in thirty-two African countries about the biggest concerns and the priorities. And job security was mentioned in thirty-seven percent of them. Researchers also noticed that the better our people were. The were the more they consider joblessness a pressing national issue. Wealthy people are much more likely than poor people to see unemployment as their country's number one problem. About twice as likely as the very poorest, says Brian Howard, Afrobarometer's. 
publications managers. But even among the poor, unemployment outranks education. He adds. Okay, I'm gonna stop right here, and then let's go to the note. Oh, let's go to the note I have prepared for you guys to study. And now, two vocabulary words for today. Oh, two vocabulary words for today. And now we're going to define those two vocabulary words. Meaning, usage, pronunciation, and definition. We use the spelling bees, pronunciation, and the spelling、oh, skill. Okay, let's take a look at the first vocabulary word, which is barometer. 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 Definition of barometer. In English, noun, an instrument measuring atmospheric, atmospheric pressure, used especially in forecasting the weather and determining altitude. Example sentences: Various instruments like thermometers and barometers are used to measure these. Origin means 17th century from Greek, baros, weight, meter. Okay, let's take a look at the second vocabulary words. Continent, continent, continent. Noun. Any of the world's main continuous expanses of land, Africa. And Antarctica, Asia, Australia, Europe, North America, South America. Example sentences: These deep, sandy sea flows like a meeting place between the two continents of Africa and Asia. Origin means 16th century, denoting a continuous tract of land. From Latin terra, continent, continuous land. Okay, now we I'm going to repeat the pronunciation and definition part for the for the two vocabulary words. And this time I want to follow with me. I want to read along with me. Okay. Now let's start. Barometer. 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 Definition of barometer in English: noun, an instrument measuring atmospheric pressure, used especially in forecasting the weather and determining determining. Altitude. Example sentences: Various instruments like thermometers and barometers are used to measure these. Origin: Seventeenth century from Greek, baros, weight, and meter. Okay, let's take a look for a second vocabulary word now: continent. Continent, continent, noun. Any of the world's main continuous expanses of land: Africa, Antarctica, Asia, Australia, Europe, North America, South America. Example sentences: These deep, sandy sea flows. Like a meeting place between the two continents of Africa and Asia. Origin: Mid 16th century, denoting a continuous tract of land. From Latin terra continens, continuous land. 
Okay, now students, it's time. Uh, we're going to redefine those two vocabulary words. We can use uh, phonics, uh, scale uh, to redefine, uh, give a new, new definition for uh, how to uh, the spelling strategy for those two uh, vocabulary words. Let's take a look at the first vocabulary word barometer. Barometer. Okay, we're looking at the first barometer. Okay, this is a bit different, huh? 